is used to make payments, clear debts, and above all, it does so with the authority of the law. This type of money is legal tender. It's illegal to refuse payment in it. In practice, making payments, say to buy a house, with this stuff is terribly inefficient. The banks carry out instructions on our behalf to make payments. They keep it in two forms. They have in their vaults, behind the counter, they have some of this stuff. And that actually takes the physical form of notes. They also have credit items on the central bank balance sheet, which is the account that they, the banks, maintain with the central bank, just as we, as members of the public, maintain accounts, deposits, with our own clearing banks, commercial banks, settlement banks, whatever you want to call it. So, the monetary base, high card money, whatever you want to call it, has three main types of asset. It has the money that we, the public, hold in the form of notes, legal tender notes, and it has banks' own till money, also in the form of legal tender notes, and then it has banks' cash reserves, the commercial banks, the liability of the central bank, and that's part of the monetary system.